New enchanteds for the collection? Let's get into it. <sighs> well, I come to you today feeling very calm, comfortable, very at ease with the situation. What's about to happen with today's video? Why do you ask? We'll get into that momentarily, but first, let's get into today's video. We, we got a great video. I'm going to show you a couple of cool things that I picked up for the collection, but first, Let's get into just a little warm up and let's let's warm up with opening a few packs of Shimmering Skies. Now, I promised that I would let you know why I'm feeling so at ease with the situation. And the reasoning behind that, you actually would be able to get that answer in our last episode. And if you want to see that episode, go check that episode out. I would go see that video. I would go watch that video if I were you. It's it's a good one. It is a it's a very good one and um it's been a long time coming, and I, I, you know, it's it's funny. I, oh, Robin Hood, beautiful. I don't. I feel like I feel like we haven't seen him in a while. I feel like we haven't seen that legendary in a while. Awesome when we're just warming up with a few packs to pull a legendary. That is very cool. I, I do. I really do love seeing that. That that is awesome. Very very cool thing. Very nice. Awesome start. Um, yeah, but we we're, we're feeling very good about the situation. I will say now now I'm at the point where. I mean, of course, like, I still have so much more I need to do with Shimmering Skies, and that's something, you know, as, as most collectors know, that's not something that, with any set, you, with any set, you don't do that overnight, you do that, you know, over months, you know, a lot of times years of, of you know, opening and acquiring stuff and trading for stuff and you know, things like that, and, you know, I my journey is far from over with, with Shimmering Skies, but um, it's just very cool to, you know, to, to uh, have what happened happen the other day. Um, very special, but now I will say, uh, and I've, I've called it out on the channel before, one one goal that I really do want to have happen, and I, I would love, it's kind of a needle in a haystack kind of thing, I, I hope I can do it for y'all, uh oh, sticky, I hope I can do it for y'all, but it would be um, the Clarabelle Legendary Cold Foil. I know I've called it out before, if you're a first time watcher of the, of the channel, and you know, I've it's the last legendary that we need in cold foil to complete the legendaries, which that that's a big deal for me. Like I, I really, I, I, it's something. Ooh, Madam Mim, awesome card. I love that. I don't know that I have. I don't know that I have the super in in cold foil. That's awesome. Um, but yeah, first and foremost, like of course, goal number one is every enchanted. Obviously, that's something that you can't do that without. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta acquire them. You gotta trade for them. I mean, that that's not, you know, that's not something that you're gonna pull. That would take. Oh my gosh, that would be, that'd be so bad. Um, but oh man, these are kind of, these are kind of open. Look at, look at, look at that. What a disaster. That was a disaster. It's okay. It's open. I mean, it's fine. But these are open and all funky today. But that's okay. That's cool. But yeah, I mean, that's that's something that that's gonna take me forever to do, and that's okay. Like that's a journey we'll go on together. But. The next thing and the, the next goal, like goal number two, like the the like gold medal goal would be enchantments. Silver medal goal is um, the legendaries in cold foil. That and that is actually something, especially for Namari. Very cool, especially for how many like packs we open. That actually feels like something that is achievable, like achievable, like on the channel. I, like I truly feel like we can do that together. Um, so I'm hoping, I'm hoping that I see it. We'll still open a lot more Shimmering Skies in the next, you know, few weeks here before, um, before Azure comes out. But, um, yeah, I'm hoping I can see it. If I do, I would feel like, I'd feel pretty good about like, um, you know, just like what we've been able to achieve, you know, opening packs together. We've seen some awesome things with Shimmering Skies. It, it's, it's truly been fun getting to open it in front of all y'all and, oh, Genie, beautiful. Again, the purples, the yellows, man, just absolutely, the blues, just just beaming colors. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And into our boy Pete. Awesome, all right. One more pack. Let's get in the feels, let's get in the flow. Let's, 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 let's make a memory. Fun, uh, fun little warm up though. Seriously, very fun. Uh, what, two, two legendaries? And I think we, I think we're warming up with, I mean, I think it's just like a handful of packs. Like, that's a pretty fun little warm up. Very, very, very cool. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if we can find a little something, something hanging out in this last, in this last pack here. We have your welcome. Let's just stare and look at this card for a second. Hmm. You know what? Just something about this card. Just something about this card. Recently, just has me feeling some type of way. That's an Easter egg, by the way. Okay. 
Sven. Oh. Magic of Dispel. Chicha. And Bruni. That was a fun warm-up. That was a really fun warm-up. Couple of couple of legendaries. Very, very cool. Okay, so now we get into a couple of pickups for the collection. So obviously, like, you know, we're working through trying to pick up all the enchants for Shimmering Skies and a bunch of other sets, right? And so I got this in I got this in a trade that I did with somebody. Um, very cool, someone who I, I mean, we, we, we go back and forth on a lot of different stuff and quite frankly, I think this person is now buying things because that they're buying Lorcana because I think they know that like they can trade me for it. So they're acquiring Lorcana, which is actually, I'm, I'm here for it. I'm, to, I'm totally here for it. Um, I was going to make, I was good here. I'll, let, let's show you the first card here for it. Let, let's, let's show you this first card. So first and foremost, we have Royal Tantrum looking absolutely gorgeous here. So I was going to make a joke about how I'm really good at buying enchanteds and not very good at pulling them. But you know, hey, at least I'm able to like, at least I'm able to like not fully be joking about that, you know, with myself. Like that, that actually makes me feel very good because it was gonna be a really, really dark, really sad joke. So that, that's, that, that makes, that makes me feel good. Like, cause this, I was, I was gonna maybe cry in front of you all in front of, in front of a camera uh, as, as that was happening. But anyway, it was really beautiful, really beautiful card, perfect condition. Um, Perfect centering on the front and back. Unlike this next one I'm gonna show you, which is perfectly fine, because honestly, for me, all I care about is that the card, the print lines, scratching, corners, the edges, I, that's truly what I care about. Like, and honestly, if, and, and a lot of times, like, and, and y'all let me know in the comments how you feel about this, but sometimes, like, in other sets, or not other sets, other, other TCGs, cards can sneak through in PSA and get a 10, having the back be slightly off center. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I, I mean, truly like my experience has always been, it depends on the grader, but at the same time, it's like, I'm fully prepared that it might not get it. And that's totally okay. Like I'm, I'm totally fine with that. Like it's it's really like, cause it's a perfectly pristine card and that's that's what I care about. But let's show this off. Cause man, this card, this is, this is an absolutely gorgeous card. We have Scar. Vengeful Lion, and I gotta tell you, I put it next to the Mufasa, and it is just like, it looks so, it looks so good next to it. Like the contrast of the blue and the green, like they just knocked it out of the park with the, with the Mufasa and the Scar artworks and Shimmering Skies. Absolutely, absolutely beautiful. But yeah, here, I'll show you the back, and like if you can kind of see, like I'll try and, I'll try and get it in, try and get it in focus for you here though, but you can kind of see that like it's pretty, Probably just a little, a, just a little right to left. It lean, it, it leans right just slightly. Um, the the thing is, is like you know, so many people talk like you know, 60-40 rule and stuff like that. But honestly, what's tough about that, and this this might just be my logic, like that I that I think to myself. But like, if I if 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 to my if to my untrained eye, I can see it, and it's like, and it's like. You, I can see that it's off, right? Like, even if it's in that range, a lot of times you see it get a nine. Now, granted, it is the back. I don't really know how they're doing centering on the back. I, truly, if you, like, if you're someone who grades cards, if, you, if you're someone who grades Lorcana in the comments, let me know. Like, if you if you grade a lot of Lorcana cards in the comments, let me know, because I'll be interested to see. I'm gonna grade it anyway, like, at some point. I'm, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to, I'm trying to build things up so I can do, like, a big, like PSA return, stuff like that. But at the same time, if I'm gonna do it, I kinda wanna just do it in one wave. So, um, I, I'll, and I'll probably, we'll, we'll see how I break it down. I'm not sure how I wanna sort of, you know, bring that content to y'all, but don't worry, I mean, that that's coming. But but anyway, um, super happy to have both these cards in the in the collection and yeah, just figure I'd come on and have a chill little day and, and show them to you and uh, yeah, just uh, just really happy that, uh, that, we can, that we can keep the collection journey going, especially on the Shimmering Sky side. All right, y'all, that's gonna do it for today's episode. If you enjoyed today's content, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all so much for the love you've been giving us in the comments, in the Discord, all the support. We love chatting it up in both of those spots with you all. Let's keep the conversation going in the Discord. We are so appreciative of you all. We are eternally grateful for you all. And until next time, we'll see you all on the other side. Peace out.